Types of breasts according to shapes. Female breasts can develop in various shapes and sizes. For women, their body shape is everything and the role of the breast is important in this. If it is said that breasts make women's bodies attractive, then it will not be wrong. Breasts change in size according to age and will naturally sag as a person get older. These changes are considered normal, but they can be a cause for concern in some cases. Therefore, it's important to have the right information about breast shape. That's why in this video, I will explain about breast sizes and shapes. To know about all this in detail, watch this video till the end. Both males and females have breasts and in females, they are essentially mammary glands which produce milk in preparation for the birth of a baby. Superficially, the breast area consists of three prominent parts, the breast, the nipple and the areola, the pink or brown circle that surrounds the nipple. Breasts are made up of mostly fat glands and a network of ducts through which milk can pass from the glands to the nipples. The amount of fat in breasts largely determines their size. Fat surrounds the milk producing mammary glands and gives breasts their characteristic round shape. There are many different types of breasts for women around the world than we know. Breasts come in all women with different shapes, sizes, colors, big or small, medium, perky. These are all normal breasts. There is no ideal breast shape. They are divided into several sizes based on different types of textures and nipples. It doesn't matter which type you have, they are all normal. Let us know which are the normal breast shapes. A symmetrical shape. It has been found that the shape and size of the right and left breast for no women are identical. In fact, it is quite common that one breast will be larger than the other. The asymmetrical shape means breasts are not identical to one another. The size of one breast is slightly larger than that of the other breast. However, the degree of asymmetry will vary from person to person. Some people have one breast that is noticeably larger or smaller than the other. Other asymmetric breasts have minor differences that typically go unnoticed. Athletic shape this type of breast is wider than other shapes. Athletic breasts have less tissue and more muscles. Having athletic breasts does not mean that you are a sports person. It has nothing to do with if you are athletic or not. Bell shape Bell-shaped breasts tend to be narrow at the top and fuller at the bottom. Their shape looks like a bell, hence they are known as bell-shaped. They typically occur in people with larger breasts. Closet shape Females with this breast shape might notice that their breasts meet in the middle of the chest or are very close to each other. They have little or no space between them. They sit right in the middle of the chest. Also, there is a greater distance between the underarm and the breast. Round shape The shape of this type of breast is the same from top and bottom. They are full and uniform on the top and bottom and nipples are exactly at the front. The texture is also in a circular shape and these breasts do not need bra support. East-West breast shape East-West breasts are not in front but are in opposite directions to each other and nipples face outwards towards arms instead of straight ahead. This means to say that the nipples are pointed in opposite direction away from each other. Side-set breast shape Side-set breasts are similar to East-West shapes. Side-set breasts tend to be a bit more full in their shape and there is a wider gap between them than usual. Also, the nipples are slightly on the side instead of being in front. Relaxed shape These ones look just like they sound. Relaxed breasts have a relaxed or elongated shape. These breasts are softer with lax tissue and the nipples sit lower but they may or may not point downward. Remember, saggy breasts and relaxed breasts aren't the same things. Slender shape Slender shaped breasts are slightly thin from the top and are full size from the bottom. The nipples on which are placed towards the bottom and point slightly downwards. Such breasts are larger in length and less in width. Teardrop shape Teardrop breasts are circular but slightly slimmer on the top than at the bottom. In this, the nipples are slightly bent rather than tight. Their shape resembles that of a drop of tears. Conical shape if the breasts are sharp instead of round in shape, then it is a conical shape. The top of breast slope down toward the nipples which point outward. Breast development is the first sign of puberty. The average age for puberty in girls is 11 years old, but can be earlier from around the age of 8 to as late as 14 years old for some. 
Most girls' breasts tend to stop growing by the age of 23. The shape and size of a woman's breast areola and nipples keep changing during her life and depend completely on genetic factors, age, weight fluctuations, hormones, diet, pregnancy, lifestyle, and the kind of support they give during and after development. Breast size and shape are dependent on numerous factors, many of which are outside of our control. All breasts are different and there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. Breast development is unique to every girl. Some start breast development a little early and some a little later. Each girl's experience will be different. It does not matter whether your breasts are small or big. However, they are cute because they are a part of your body and should be taken care of. They don't need to be perky, high set or super large to be healthy or beautiful. It's totally fine to embrace them as they are. If you like this video, please give this video a like, share it with your friends and don't forget to click the subscribe button to enjoy more such videos. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Bye-bye.